Hi, I'm Wally and I'm staying at Fisher House. Uh, so I'm a serving soldier, uh, currently 32 years uh, in, uh, and I'm based over in Cyprus. In 2012, I was one, one of the military liaison officers and it caught the back end of Afghanistan. At the same time, uh, they were building Fisher House. Uh, and so I seen it from a base, a base foundation, uh, building its framework. Uh, and I remember coming down here and just seeing the facility at uh, work um, because the, the previous um, places that families uh, were located was obviously Alexander Lines and Norton House, which although Norton House was an extremely uh, lovely, you know, homely uh, place, uh, it just didn't have the capacity that Fisher House has. So Fisher House with its sort of 18 bedroom facility um, and just the way it's set up, uh, you know, to see it in its latter stages of building, um, I always wondered when I came to uh, my end here as a military liaison officer, would I ever be a patient? In October 10, I realised that uh, my, my right leg uh, wasn't kicking the football as it usually does and I started to lose power. And so after investigation, uh, the, the arthritis set in and so uh, I needed some uh, work done on it. I decided to go and have uh, a new hip. I had the operation done uh, in April 21 and then moved up to Fisher House. When I found out about the operation, um, my aspiration uh, was literally linking with Fisher House. Um, and I remember Patrick and Julie, the management team here, uh, and all the staff associated, which are pretty much the same as from when I was here. And just to reconnect with them has just made my life a lot more easier. Uh, and so Fisher House has provided an outstanding opportunity uh, just through its atmospherics, it's a relaxing environment. I've been able to just recover, do all my physio, cover my work, swim uh, in, in the Morris Centre next door. And so for me, this is an absolutely perfect place uh, to support my, my particular and individual uh, recovery. Coming back as a patient and actually staying in the facility and having the benefit uh, is just absolutely unbelievable. Uh, and I always knew it was going to be a good place, um, but if I rated it in stars, it's five star right across the board. And actually on reflection, you know, uh, although I've had a hip operation and needed 34 staples, listening to some of the others, um, it's just like a little graze, you know, and actually I'm fortunate to have come back to England from Cyprus, have the operation uh, and come back to a, an absolutely perfect place to recover outstanding, meaningful and atmospheric, uh, how I would describe Fisher House. I think the kitchen, as you come up the corridor of the main house, um, you know, where I, I'm staying in, in room Gibraltar, um, you have to go past the kitchen uh, and you know if there's a light on because they're automatic, then there's going to be someone around that area. Uh, and just even if you make a brew, you know, you'll bump into somebody uh, and you always say good morning and it just always then just creates a, a, a chat. Uh, and I always say that going for a cup of tea can be up to a two hour long uh, task uh, and you end up having another cup of tea and just either reminiscing on, you know, people that have been in the military, uh, the veterans that are staying in here and, and uh, come into contact with the place. And I just think that, you know, that area for me, it's communal. communal. Um, it's a place where you can go and relax discuss with others uh, their journey um, and also you know when you've when you've shared a problem you've halved a problem it costs 25 pound for a family uh, to stay in fisher house so your personal contribution has a huge impact in allowing this facility to run and allow soldiers like me and veterans to stay in here and get the medical attention and recovery. Everybody's contribution, as small as it is, donated, is such appreciated.